Hello, welcome to camglash.com. It's me again. My name is Teacher Camille, and today we are going to continue learning about MTC's dictionary of everyday American English expressions. We will continue on Unit Fifteen. Are you ready now? Okay, let's start. As you can see, we are now on six hundred sixty-seven. Asking about the location of some place. Sometimes, when we don't know the place or the exact area that we are going to go to on shopping, we can ask the person on the line where is the exact place or the exact location. So, as I've talked about from the previous uh, video classes. We use the WH question when we are asking. So we will practice the following phrases using WH questions. Are you ready? Okay. We will practice the first phrase. Where are you located? Where are you located? Okay. Now it's your turn to practice. Okay, very good job. Let's go to the second phrase. Where is your store? Where is your store? Okay, now it's your turn. Okay, very good job. And as you can see on the next phrase, I box a word nearest. It means this word can be also used. So let's practice first using the phrase without nearest. Okay? You can repeat after me. What are the cross streets? What are the cross streets? Okay, now it's your turn. Okay, very good job. Now let's practice the phrase with the word nearest. What are the nearest cross streets? What are the nearest cross streets? Okay, now it's your turn. Okay, very good job. Let's continue practicing the phrases still using WH question. What's your nearest location? What's your nearest location? Okay, now it's your turn. Okay, very good job. Next phrase is Do you have any locations in the suburbs? Do you have any locations in the suburbs? When you hear the word suburbs, it means a usually residential area. Okay, now it's your turn to practice. Okay, very good job. Another phrase using still WH question, what? Let's practice. What mall are you in? What mall are you in? Okay, now it's your turn. Okay, very good job. Next phrase and the last phrase is using the question how. You can also use this. So let's practice. How do I get there? 
How do I get there? Okay, now it's your turn. Okay, very good job. There is something that I want you to remember when you're going to ask about the location. First is you need to be kind because some operators or assistant operator are not really good to give you the exact place. So, giving information and details is also important. So this is what we learned in today's lesson. I hope you enjoy listening into this video class. And if you have some questions or if you would like to enroll to our company, you can go to www.camglish.com. Again, my name is Teacher Camille saying goodbye. Always take care and see you on the next class.